Welcome back to my channel. So for today's video, I'm gonna be doing another lipstick swatch tutorial video for you guys on these brand new Cherry Mousse Matte Liquid Lipsticks <laughs> from Hank and Henry Beauty. So I recently just got this PR package from them a few days ago actually. And um, if you follow me on Instagram, I did upload some swatches already on my IG stories. But of course, I wanted to do a dedicated video where I can show you guys the swatches and you guys can see what they look like on me if you are my complexion. Um, so I have all the shades here for you guys. I do have my um, phone pulled up too so I can kind of give you guys the deets. Um, so again, these are the Cherry Mattes Full Collection. Um, and they do have it where you can buy the entire set. It originally was $221, um, but it just dropped down to $97. So if you guys are interested in buying the whole collection, they do have the Archie Bundle which I'm guessing are all um, the nudes. Um, and this one runs for $48 and you get five lipsticks. Um, and then we have the Veronica bundle, which I think are the more burgundy shades. Um, and this one runs for $48 and you get four um, liquid lipsticks. And then we have the other like burnt orange and the red shade in there. Um, and that bundle, you get four. Um, liquid lipsticks for $48 as well. So I'm noticing that I wonder if you can buy them separately. I hope you can. Um, let me check. Hold, please. Okay, I couldn't find them and I was getting worried. I was like, oh my gosh, I think you can only buy them as a bundle. But no, I found them. So they do run for $17 each and they have them all here for you guys if you just want to buy like one or two. But you do have the choice of buying them in a bundle. Um, so I don't remember what color I have on because I did just recently do like a quick TikTok video and I slapped one on. Um, I put it back in the bunch. I am so dumb and I actually put it on the side because I was like, let me, um, while I do my intro, I'm going to show you guys which one I have on. Um, yeah, that definitely failed because I put it back and now I don't know which one it is. Um, but of course I'm going to be doing the swatches here, so I will be able to find out which one is the one that I have on. But this one is absolutely beautiful. You guys already know me. I'm such a sucker for nudes. This nude shade is beautiful. I can already describe the formula for you guys. It is more on the dry side. Um, I know that these um, claim to be more like of a mousse, but like it glides on very nicely like a mousse, but once it does dry, it kind of feels, um, I don't know if you guys are familiar with like the ColourPop cosmetics. It kind of has that same formula, but it was really easy to glide on and has really great pigmentation. Um, but yeah, I just wanted to throw that out there. So I have 13 liquid lipsticks that I have to swatch for you guys. Um, since I really want you guys to see the color, I'm not going to be applying a lip liner. And of course, I'm also going to do some swatches on my arm so you guys can see them. Let's go ahead and start with number one. I'm going to go ahead and remove this and let's get to swatching. Hi, <laughs> you guys are super close. Um, I thought it was just better so you guys can really see the color. So the first one that I'm going to go into you guys is called Buffont. Hopefully I'm saying that right. If you are new to my channel, I suck at pronunciations. I use names sometimes on makeup products. I'm like, what? <laughs> so if you want to correct me, feel free to comment down below. But I just want to let you guys know that I suck at pronouncing things. And I always say this. I don't know how I graduated high school. I don't know. <laughs> All right, guys. So here we have Beau Font. And wow. <laughs> it is really nude. <laughs> This color, you guys, I feel like maybe because I'm not wearing a lip pencil, so I always wear like a brownie um, lip pencil, like, you know, the ColourPop BFF3 or BFF2, um, Morphe Sweet Tea, Vive Cosmetics, and Bark. Um, so I, every time I wear something super, super nude like this, I have to have like a nice brown undertone lip pencil. Um, so this is really really um nude and very pale on me okay next up we have fat cat <laughs> um it's another nude shade i wonder if this is the one that i was using because it kind of looks like it let's see
All right, guys, this color is definitely more on the peachy tone, but I am not mad at it. I think this color is actually really, really pretty for like springtime or even like summertime. This color is really, really pretty. I like this one. Okay, next we have Man Ho Monroe. <laughs> the names are so cute. really like this color um yeah i don't think it's like super nude compared to the first one and i feel like with the brown lip um pencil this will really look fire next we have patty cake now we have brick um haws <laughs> then we have daddy O. I think this is the one yep yeah, I think this is the one you guys that I went into let's see oh yep yeah, this is it I think because I remember it had like a nice brown undertone uh-huh I think this one's it so this is the one that I went into with my brown um, lip pencil. Um, once again, it's in the shade called Daddy O, and I love this one. Yep, this is the one. Now we have Back Seat Bingo. <laughs> Ooh, this is pretty. I really, really like this color for like October. I don't know, I think because as soon as I opened it, it just like fall automatically, you know, came into my head and then a picture of a pumpkin popped into my head. So this is definitely a color that I would wear for the fall season. As you guys can see, they dry really, really fast. So it's a good thing, you know, it's not a bad thing. So as soon as you slap it on, <laughs> it stays. All right, next we have Cha Cha Cha. <laughs> Ooh, this was pretty. Ooh, yeah, this is nice. I'm glad we went with the darker shades at the end. And just keep in mind, you guys, that I don't have a lip pencil on, so, you know, it doesn't look as clean um, because the purpose is for you guys just to really just see the color of these liquid lipsticks. Um, so if I look like Chupitos, don't come for me, okay? <laughs> Next up, we have Betty Riso. Or Riso. Or Riso. This also is giving me like fall vibes, pumpkin vibes. I just like how these are super pigmented. I don't know if you guys are noticing that as soon as I'm applying it on my lips, um, like you don't have to go into the tube many times to pick up some more product. Um, so I really like that. Um, this color again is Betty Riso. This one, you guys, I'm actually really excited to slap on because I love myself a nice red lipstick. Um, this one's called Betty Boo. Um, so I'm really excited to slap this one on. Ooh. I love this red, you guys. It is so pretty, so pigmented. It's not streaky. And it actually feels really comfortable on the lips. Um, I'm not gonna lie about that um i'm just really impressed by the pigmentation you guys of these liquid lipsticks she don't want to come off <laughs> oh my god i look crazy come on you can do it we have um choke a lot Ooh, this one's nice and dark oh it's a brown yes this color is beautiful. It's still a little wet, so I can only imagine once it starts to get nice and like matte. This is really pretty. Wow, I really like this one. This one again is called Choke A Lot. Okay, we have Jitterbug Judy. Oh, this color is so pretty too. Wow. Wow, this color is so stunning. I like this one. Okay, we're down to the very last one, and this one's called Rusty Road. All 
All right, my honeys, so you guys just saw all 13 liquid lipsticks and my lips are going through hell right now. <laughs> They're throbbing a little bit, um, but I have to do what I gotta do for you guys. Um, what did you think of the colors? I wanna know your guys' thoughts um, and let me know down in the comments which one is your favorite. Right now, what I wanna do is actually apply Daddy-O and go in with a um, lipstick or a lip liner for you guys and show you guys the final result if you were to use a lip pencil with one of these um, nude lipsticks. So for the lip pencil today you guys I'm gonna go into the KKW Beauty and collab with Mario. Now I'm gonna go ahead and apply my liquid lipstick in the shade Daddy-O. Now if you guys remember um, the lipstick looked very pale very, very nude because obvio we didn't have a lip pencil. And for me, it's really crucial to have a lip pencil whenever I go in with any lip product. I just feel like it makes a huge difference. It makes my lips look a little bit more bigger and plumpier. Um, so I just can't go without it. As you guys can see, as soon as you apply a lip pencil, cambia el color and it just looks, I don't know. I just love a good nude lipstick with a brown lip pencil. All right, so here we have the lipstick on. Now I'm gonna go ahead and just tap it with my finger. And what this does, you guys, it really helps to warm up the product, um, but it also helps it to look nice and matte. Before I let you guys go, I just wanna give you my overall thoughts on these liquid lipsticks. Um, so I love the formula. I think it just glides on very well. It is super pigmented, and as you guys saw, I didn't have to constantly keep going into the tube to pick out any more product. They dry really fast, like it's just crazy on how fast they do dry. Um, but I will say that they are more on the dry side. They are definitely not hydrating. Um, so for anybody who doesn't like using a really dry liquid lipstick, you probably won't like these, because um, they do kind of remind me of the color pop. Um, lipsticks which for me personally it doesn't bother me um, I also I don't know if you guys noticed that when I was trying to take it off with my Neutrogena makeup wipe like the darker lipsticks you guys would not come off like <laughs> so in a way it kind of makes me think that if you're wearing a mask you know it's not gonna transfer and it's not gonna budge and it's gonna stay in place like I'm going like this and it's not sticking to the top or the bottom it's not cracking um, so I think it should be fine Maybe if like the formula would be a little bit less dry, um, then you know we would be golden, but it doesn't bother me personally. But with everything you guys, you know that whenever I review things, uh, whatever may work for me, it may not work for you and vice versa. Um, so I definitely leave these products up to you guys, um, but I definitely do recommend them. I think all the colors are absolutely beautiful and pop on a lip pencil and you are seriously golden. Um, so I'm gonna leave this up to you guys if you need any more lipsticks in your life. Um, before you do leave my channel, do not forget to like, share, and subscribe. Share it with a friend. And I will see you guys in my next video very, very soon. Besitos. Los quiero mucho. Bye.